the many issues school leaders are starting to discuss is custodians and the critical role that they will play in fighting the pandemic when schools reopen. This was a big topic at last night's Clay County School Board meeting. The members discussed how they can be sure to have enough workers to deep clean school buildings. News for Jax has several reporters covering the latest developments in the pandemic. We begin with Scott Johnson, who's joining us live. Scott has been checking with school districts all over the region. Scott. Uh, Mary, so I was down in Clay hearing about this last night. Tonight, we're in Duval asking questions of all the local districts. What are you going to do? You need to have custodians in day-to-day -day regularly to clean a school. Now, do you need more in case there's a positive case inside? The issue was a critical one in Clay County as Superintendent David Broski showed this graphic to the school board about the cleaning needs schools will have. Board members peppered him with questions about needed deep cleaning. The district is looking at possibly hiring seven more custodians to help out. One of the challenges is, and, and I don't mind, you know, kind of sharing this with the crowd, is the hiring of custodians is a challenge. And uh, that's for a variety of reasons. It's a challenging job, and the pay is, is not uh, is not what you can you can get at Amazon or, or other places. And I mean, I hate to say that out loud as superintendent, but it's the truth. I also heard back from St. Johns County. It has 305 active custodians and has only worked to fill positions for their schools like normal. Additional spots have not been filled since the pandemic. The district is building two new schools right now, but it's trying to still hire custodians for those schools. They also tell me they will be using a new cleaner called OmniShield that can clean services for 90 days. And I'm still waiting to get word back from Duval County on where they are at as far as making sure they have enough custodians on staff. Just heard from Nassau County a little bit ago. They tell me they have 92 on staff. No word on if they have any problems. For now, we're live. Scott Johnson, Channel 4, The Local Station.